What's up, everybody? It's your boy Juice back at it again. And today we are opening up first edition gym challenge packs. Why everybody is mowing the lawn outside, ladies and gentlemen. We don't want to wait any longer. We are going to go ahead and open up these packs today. The first pack here, we believe that some of these are actually going to be really heavy. We don't know about the, the first couple we're going to open up. So here we go. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. And as you can see, I got my Kevin hat in the background eating the broccoli right there, ladies and gentlemen. If you're a fan of The Office, that is where that's from. We don't do any card tricks here. We are just opening up packs. Here we go. Oddish, Kokos Grimer, Misty's Magic Carp, and the Blaine Rare right there. Okay, okay, okay. Looks like there's a little ink dot on that bad boy too, which, believe it or not, could be more collectible. The centration on these cards are actually really nice too, so hopefully we pull some hollows at the end. Viridian City Gym is the trainer. Giovanni's, uh, Giovanni's Nidorino and a Energy Leaf right there. Not bad. Beautiful first edition set. Here we go. Next pack. I think the last four could be heavy. These were questionable. When we took a look, we'll try to preserve. This guy has been mowing the lawn, and fan blowing, whatever he's doing out there for, feels like an eternity, but mm -hmm. that's okay. Here we go. Brock's Diglett. Did you say me? Yeah, you. <laughs> Giovanni's Meow. Misty's Star You. Ooh, War Point. Sabrina's Ghastly. Ooh, transparent walls. And all right, Sabrina's Gold Duck is the non hollow there. We're looking for the holographic of this one because the pop is so low. Koga's Kakuna. The Beedrill would be dope to get. Koga's Ninja Trick. Now, this Pokemon card was actually updated for the American release. This symbol right here actually what looked like a swastika and that's why they changed it however in japan the symbol that was here is actually i believe a, a term of like friendship um but around the world obviously it was it was looked at something else as something else brock's graveler and then the fire energy not bad Side of things to come. here we go okay Holy smokes, ladies and gentlemen, there he is, Koga, the gym leader. Which gym leader artwork is your favorite? I'm going to have to go with probably, believe it or not, I actually like the Koga one. The Sabrina's one's really good too. Ah, it's tough though because Giovanni's awesome. Giovanni's really awesome, but here we go. Gio, speaking of Giovanni, there's his Nina Ran, Brock's Geodude. There's the trainer, Blaine's Doduo. Sabrina's Abrak. Does that mean we're going to get the Alakazam? Misty's Horsey. Ooh, and there is the rare. Okay. Giovanni's Last Resort. That means these three packs are in, should be heavy because they were weighing heavy. That means we're saving the fire for right now, ladies and gentlemen. Rocket's Secret Experiment. Sabrina's Mr. Mine. Then the Psychic Energy. Oh, you don't want to sleep that one? <laughs> here we go ladies and gentlemen here we go oh my goodness Sabrina's drowsy Misty's Magikarp, Misty's Poliwag, Giovanni's Machop, Koga's Coughing, Sabrina's Porygon, and oh, Brock's Ninetales. Let's go. Wow. Oh, the centering is off a little bit from uh, left to right. Wow, that card is beautiful. The good thing is there's no print lines. Hopefully that's a good sign. And then the back, you can tell it's off centered. I might get an OC grade, which would be kind of cool. I know OC grades give it a little bit more premium. 
um, for collectors out there. So that might be something to look forward to. Excellent. Sabrina's Cadabra. Erica's Venus or Ivysaur. Wow, the Erica's uh, Venusaur is actually really dope as a 10. Wow, that's a beautiful card. It's like a real photo with Ivysaur mixed in. The Master Ball and an energy card. All right, here we go. Holy smokes. I saw the red down there. I know, I thought I thought it was the Zard. I thought it was Zard, man. What is he, five in this? No, he's two. He is two. Number one is Alakazam, number two is Charizard. There's Sabrina Sporty Ooh, this is a really good card to get graded. Lieutenant Surge's Pikachu in the centering on his beautiful. Probably get an instant 10. Good card to get. There's Blaine's Mankey. Blaine's Ponyta. Is that a sign? Koga's Tangula. Erica's Jigglypuff. Oh, Giovanni's Gyarados. Whoa. Let's go. And the centering on this is so much better. Wow. Can this get a 10? Wow, look at that. No print lines. Look at the end of the camera. Wow. That is beautiful. No print lines. The centering on the front is perfect. The back is looking really nice, ladies and gentlemen. This up here is just like part of the card. I'm not even... Yeah, just a little bit of fuzz. The back is slightly off center, but I still think it, it's going to get a 10. That is a beautiful card. Beautiful card. Okay, here, let's do this. We got one pack left, ladies and gentlemen. There is a Lieutenant Surge's Raticate. Sabrina's Kadabra. Erica's Ivysaur again. Another great card to get. You might actually want to get those Ivysaurs graded. And then the Lightning Energy. Okay, last pack, Magic. Here we go. Koga. This is the heaviest pack. Big wins, Charizard's in there. What do we want? What are we trying to pull? Well, you got the you got the uh, nine tails, which is actually a really nice pull. So you want to get the you want to get the Arcanine, you want to get Blaine's Charizard, you want to get um, Misty's Gold Duck, Koga's B Drill if it's a perfect card. Uh, I mean, there's like four or five hollows in this set that are already over, well over a thousand bucks as a PSA ten. Cool. Roll. Here we go, Supreme's Ghastly. Erica's Oddish. Blaine's Growlithe. Is that a sign? Sabrina's Drowsy. <sighs> Misty's Magikarp. Misty's Poliwag. This should be the rare. Oh, Koga's Ditto. Dang. Dang. Womp, womp, womp. That's all right, though. <sighs> Koga's Ditto. Not too bad at all. You know what? We're not going to end on that note. I'm going to go ahead and get out my cards that I was going to open up because I believe there's one heavy pack. Sabrina's Jinx and the Energy. And we're back. Okay, so this is my heavy pack. I purchased four packs and one of them were heavy. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open this one up. Gym Challenge is my second favorite set from Wizards of the Coast. Let's see what we get. Okay, here we go. Sabrina's Porygon. Giovanni's Machop. Koga's Pidgey. Erica's Jigglypuff. Blaine's Ponyta. Giovanni's Magikarp. And, oh, Giovanni's Nidoking. Let's go. Not bad at all, ladies and gentlemen. It's a little off-center, but that's okay. Oh, might get an OC grade. Imagine getting an OC grade on these bad boys. Not bad at all, ladies and gentlemen. They got the little pups barking in the back. Fantastic. All right, and we're going to wrap it up here with the Sabrina's Haunter, Saffron City Gym, Blaine's a quiz, number three, and the energy. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. We got some pretty decent pulls out of here. We got the, the nine tails, which was probably the hit of the video. We did get Koga's Ditto. Brock's nine tails is pretty awesome. Giovanni's Gyarados is moving up in price. And so is this beautiful Giovanni's Nidoking that hopefully gets an OC grade. 
Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. We'll talk to you soon. Deuces, dab. Go eat your broccoli, kids.